Welcome again. In this session, we are reading Luke chapter 21, verses 1 through 4. Now, this is talking about the widow's offering. Verse 1. Speaking of Jesus, it says, He looked up and saw the rich people who were putting their gifts into the treasury. It was like a... Um, like an offering that was being collected, like a collection, like an offering. Verse 2. He saw a certain poor widow casting in two small brass coins. It says here in the notes, literally two lepta. Two lepta was about 1% of a day's wages for an agricultural laborer. 1%. He said, truly I tell you, this poor widow put in more than all of them. For all these put in gifts for God from their abundance. But she, out of her poverty, put in all that she had to live on. A few little things that we can glean from this passage. Number one is that Jesus really uh, honored what the widow did. You know, what did Jesus say? What did, what did he not say? Well, he said that the widow put in more. So what Jesus is looking at is not so much how many, you know, how much, how much money you put in, but basically what's the ratio of what you got left? You know, did you put in 1% of your, you know, your livelihood? Did you put in 10%? Did you put in 50 or did you, like the widow, put in 100%? Jesus did not stop her. And that's another thing. Um, you know, Jesus could have said, oh, no, stop that widow. She's gonna, that's all she has to live on. She needs those two coins. He did not stop her. And that's another thing that's very remarkable here. So he commended her. He praised her for what she did. And uh, he didn't stop her although she put in everything she had to live on. So next time you're doing something for God, whether it's giving money or giving anything, what God looks at, what God is more concerned about is basically what you have left or how much of, you know, how much percent did you give? You know, how much uh, do you have left over? Uh, how, you know what? What do you, um, what do you value the most? How do you give to God? Do you give just a little bit? Or do you give a lot? That's basically what Jesus is talking about. So as you go, as you go throughout your day, as the uh, time goes by, you should meditate upon what Jesus said. Meditate upon what the scriptures say. Always keep in mind what the scriptures say. Meditate upon it day and night, as it says, and keep it before your eyes, so to speak. Always think about the Word of God. Always think about God's perspective. Seek Him with all your heart, and He will be found. That is, if you seek Him with all your heart. May He enlighten the eyes of your understanding and show you great and mighty things as you do. Thanks again.